Number 10, Edge of Tomorrow. Expertly juggling multiple storylines, including the corruption of power and the theme of free will versus fate, Minority Report is a neo-noir that's got it all. Almost. Doug Liman's Edge of Tomorrow has an edge on Steven Spielberg's flick by taking a well-worn premise, time loops, and making it fresh for modern audiences. Though Tom Cruise is great in both, the latter movie, with its thrilling action, is where he really shines. Private, drop it, give me. 50 search! That's right. Telling the story of a public relations officer who's forced to relive the same day that he battles aliens and dies in the hopes of preventing his death and saving the world, Edge of Tomorrow brings humor, a badass Emily Blunt, and stunning visuals to this sure-to-be sci-fi classic. Number 9. Annihilation Sci-fi and horror often go hand in hand, but that doesn't mean they always pair well together. What is it? I don't know. In the case of this Alex Garland-directed tale featuring a perplexing realm filled with animal and plant mutations and the scientists who enter it, those genres most certainly do. Not only that, but you might also call Annihilation a smart adventure thriller, what with its stirring themes and puzzling mysteries. They've grown this way. That doesn't make any sense. One critic even called it, quote, too intellectual, but we think that should be taken as a compliment. With shimmering visuals and masterful direction, Annihilation has all the qualities of a sci-fi flick that will go down in history. It's ambitious, it is strange, and it's engrossing. Three, two... Number 8. District 9 Forget Area 51, it's District 9 that holds all the alien secrets. Redefining the classic alien invasion story, it's the humans that are the villains in this one. We are yet to solve you an eviction notice. You just put your screw in there. Okay, Hold it. After a spacecraft landed in Johannesburg back in the 80s, the South African government interned the refugee aliens and stole their technology. Decades later, a company agent, Vikas, accidentally exposes himself to a fluid that alters his human DNA and begins to transform him into an alien. What is happening to my own? Just breathe deep. What is happening to my own, doctor? Watching his plight after he begins to see things from the alien's perspective couldn't be more captivating or emotional, while the movie itself is action-packed, entertaining, and thought-provoking. If I can get you that, that black fluid, what happens then? Number 7. The Martian Though traveling to Mars is still in our future as of 2019, our children's children will probably look back on this movie with a wink and a smile. Ugh, oh, f*** you, Mars. Astronaut Mark Watney is thought dead after his team must hastily escape a storm on the Red Planet. Realizing they left him behind, his team turns back to rescue him. In addition to being highly entertaining and even humorous, the film is also a testament to human will. They say that once you grow crops somewhere, you've officially colonized it. So, technically, I colonized Mars. Watney must survive for years on his own, creating oxygen and growing food on a dead planet until his team can bring him home. Luckily for him, he's a botanist. Mars will come to fear my botany powers. Number 6. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind Joel wants to forget Clementine ever existed, so he hires Lacuna Inc. to erase his memory of her. This is a hoax, right? And this is Clem. I assure you, no. However, Joel realizes too late that he'd rather keep the painful memories as long as he can have the good ones, too. Interestingly, Joel and Clementine's story is told inside Joel's mind, so we never get to see the truth, only the way Joel remembers it. Linking parallel storylines of the Lacuna workers and the non-linear storytelling of Joel's vanishing memories, the film explores the subjectivity of memory and the way certain impulses still linger long after our memory fades. That, plus the bonus of Jim Carrey killing it in a dramatic role, secures this one's place in history. I'm scared. <laughs> don't, don't cry, baby Joel. <laughs> Number 5. Inception. Forget future classic, try instant classic. It's just a dream. It's hard to pick just one Christopher Nolan film to represent his sci-fi genius. His 2014 space-time drama Interstellar is definitely a contender, but claiming this spot is Inception. 
This visually stunning film about planting ideas in people's minds through their dreams uses the ways our dreams influence our real lives and the way that our real lives influence our dreams as its landscape. As the dependency on visual effects in film will undoubtedly continue to grow, Inception will be remembered for its impressive use of practical effects in some of its most iconic scenes, such as the tilting bar and, of course, the hallway scene. Number 4. Her This prediction of the near future of technology tells the story of Theodore, an antisocial man who falls in love with Samantha, his operating system. What's wrong? How can you tell something's wrong? I don't know. I just can. Though the narrative follows Theodore, he is not alone. He learns from Samantha that hundreds of others have fallen in love with their OSs. Even his neighbor Amy has befriended hers. Are you falling in love with her? Sounds like me, freak. No, no, I think it's... I think anybody who falls in love is a freak. Theodore's substitution of human interaction with that of an adaptive AI foreshadows our growing dependence on technology in real life. As our smartphones grow smarter, we grow more socially detached. And this movie brings up some very real and very relevant questions. You're beautiful. Thank you, Theodore. I'm kissing your head. Number 3. Ex Machina Though there have been many modern sci-fi incarnations of the man creates monster, monster destroys man story, they usually culminate in a grand and violent revolt of man versus machine. Haven't you met lots of new people before? None like you. But here, Ava overcomes her human oppressors with a gentle touch. The humanoid robot uses her womanly form to manipulate Caleb, whose purpose was to test her intelligence. Do you have people to test you or might switch you off? No, I don't. But why do I? Well, he did his job a little too well, as Ava's intelligence, though artificial, surpasses actual intelligence. We not only see her study her human counterparts and learn their weaknesses, but also see her turn them against each other. The future is female. So let's all hope that future audiences will look back on this classic wondering why a female-driven movie was such a big deal. Number 2. Children of Men in one of several hard sci-fi flicks on this list, the quite possible near future is a disaster. You scared the shit out of me. War has broken out across the world and governments have toppled. No babies have been born for 18 years, and the Earth's population is in serious danger. Upon discovering Key, a pregnant woman, Theo, a hardened former activist, is tasked with bringing her and her baby to safety. Shut up! <sighs> Trust me. We've got to go. In a mesmerizing and unforgettable scene, Theo walks Key and her baby through a building under fire, and for a brief moment, the war stops so they can escape. Though set in the future, this film is very grounded in reality and foreshadows a scary yet hopeful fate. <laughs> Hilarious. Honestly, I think I would put The Martian in my personal top 10 favorite movies list. I love it so much. With the disco music and the comedy and the tension and the great cast. Actually, these are all great movies, and I really enjoyed number one, so let's see the honorable mentions before we find out what it is. It doesn't matter. When I hurt myself, it changes your body. This is what I do now, change your memory. It doesn't matter! Goody! Goody! I found him outside. I found him outside. I do not start this war. The ape who did is dead. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Arrival With Blade Runner 2049 director Denis Villeneuve at the helm, this movie could not go wrong. A contender for Best Adapted Screenplay, Best Picture, and Best Director at the Oscars, this film is not only spectacularly written, but also cinematically beautiful. <laughs> As aliens come to Earth, linguist Louise Banks is tasked with discovering their intentions. 
If you were expecting your typical alien invasion action movie, you came to the wrong place. Arrival is a timely story of communication and understanding. Told through linear timelines as well as flashbacks or flash forwards, the film's use of time as a thematic element allows for one of the greatest twists in modern sci-fi history. You can't do it with both hands. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip